Hello and welcome to Rashi Speeches. Today's video is going to be another skin cover video, and today's skin will be Nizumi. Let's get into this video. This video is going to be another skin cover video, and the skin I'm making combos for is Nizumi, which is the next skin in my Battle Pass combos. I unlocked the second edit style yesterday, which is the Exile of Nizumi here. I was very close to getting it, but I literally just grinding a lot of the challenges. I only have two weeklies left to do. I've done all the My, my Hero Academia set from one. And not too bad, to be fair. I actually enjoyed the time on the creative game mode, which was on the Hero Training Gym. It actually was pretty fun. I, that was better than I thought it was going to be. It was pretty fun. And yeah, so I made five combos for each for the standard style, which is just basically Nozumi. I, I'm using the style tied back, and I'm reactive the Nozumi for both the combos. And I also made five for the XR. Obviously, when I do eventually unlock Ascension, I'll probably make combos for that as well. Anyway, let's get to the first combo. Backlink is a Mind's Eye, which is Nozumi's backlink. I'm using the reactivity on. You can use it off if you'd prefer. Pickaxe is a Vision. So we see the eye. Because very nice with the eye on the back of the or on the back bling. Glider is a peerless parasol, which is the Victor Al Glider from this season. But if you would want to use Nozumi's, which is this one here. Whispering Wind, feel free, it's totally up to you. But I decided to stick with the glider because I've used this Victor Isle glider on all of the combos from this you know, chapter 4 season 1's battle pass. Contrail is the airbound eyes, which is Nazumi's. And then the wrap I decided to back on was Dragon's Honor, which is Iada's Iada's weapon wrap from chapter 3 season 4. So if you've got the Iada's level up quest pack and got all the 28 level up tokens, I picked them up, you'd have definitely have this wrap. Let's move on to the second combo. This one, I decided to whack on the wolf pack. Started just because I thought, why not whack on? You can whack on any sword back and it worked nicely. But I decided to whack this one on. Probably was still one of my favourites to this day. It's from Chapter 1, Season 6's Battle Pass. Pickaxe is a fanged foresight, which is Nazumi's pickaxe. I'm using just a standard edit style, which is a fanged foresight. And then the wrap is a paradigm shift from last season's Battle Pass. I find it goes very nice with the colour of his like, jacket. And I do like this wrap quite a lot. It's quite clear, so it's quite basic, but it's also quite clean at the same time. Let's move on to the next combo. I decided to back on the banner, which is on the I've pretty sure the page with his first when you first unlock Mizumi. Uh, the, sorry, second page. This one here. I'm using this banner. I'll quickly show the oh, I'll quickly show the colour I'm using. So I'm using this banner and I'm using the colour here just for grey. I think it's very nice. I'm using the banner shield, but you can't use a banner cape because you can't use any capes. So you're not allowed to this skin, so I assume it's just probably I think he's technically got a cape himself, I guess. Pickaxe is the all-seeing scythe, which is from the level up quest pack from chapter 3, season 3. So if you've got the Phantasm level up quest pack in that season and got all 28 level up tokens, you definitely have this pickaxe. I always just say definitely, obviously, level 28, because that's what all of them for obviously both edit styles as well. But I always made sure to get it done. And the wrap, and the wrap is also from the Phantasm level up quest pack. And it's a spectral vision. I thought since it's got eyes, once again, goes very nicely with this skin itself. It's got eyes on, on the obviously jacket. And I do like this pickaxe a lot. I'd say Nazumi's is very similar to this pickaxe. If you look at, say, this is obviously this is Nazumi's, and then you look at this one, it looks very similar. Let's move on to the next combo. I decided to whack on the high caliber, and I'm using the silver style. I just thought this is at the stage I wasn't really too sure how to like what to combo with the first style, so I whacked this on. I find it works pretty nicely. Pickaxe is a Walker Club, and it's from the Survivor Arms set. This is with the you can buy it in a bundle with Rick Grimes, so that's where I got it from. Or you could buy it separately. And the rap music is, in, is industrious, goes very nice with, nicely with the back bling. Let's move on to the fifth combo. I decided to work on the Shining Star. So I was trying to combo with his hair colour, but obviously his hair colour is quite unique. It's not really any back blings or, like, I don't have any back blings, pickaxes or wraps that go exactly, you know, or goes perfectly with it. Pickaxe is a sludge hammer. I'm using the Ripley style, and then the wrap is Ripley, just go like a blue theme. So obviously no ascension, he gets that blue around, which just saw his eyes go blue, so I guess it is pretty cool. Let's move on to the first Exile, British Shots Exile Nozumi. Yep, Exile Nozumi combo. This is probably my favourite combo I made in this video. It's the power panels. You can also use the Ever style of this, the Signal Sever, if you prefer to look at this one. But I decided to stick with the power panels, and I'm using the Metal Colour Heated for like the purple look. And then the wrap is Exile Emblem. If you ever do struggle, to find the wrap you want to put on the back bling. A little tip is you basically whack on the wrap here. So whatever you want. Let's say you want falling leaves, for example. Click on it. Then you press, obviously, edit it. Go down. It'll be up top left all the time for you. So that's how. That's the best way of doing it. That's how I figured that out. And I also decided to whack on the, co the code cutter. And also whack on the wrap with it. But I decided to whack hilt colour purple. Effects colour purple. Metal colour heated and an exile emblem. 
I would have used Nazumi's pickaxe with the edit style, but I don't have that yet, so I'm pretty sure it is a bonus reward. Yes, it is. It's there on the first page. I can't use that, obviously, until I get above 100. And then the wrap is Exile's emblem. It's very cool. Obviously, this backlink is very probably one of my favorite ones I've got in a while. So it just works very nice. It's a combo I've been using when I've been running around with Nazumi. Let's move on to the second Exile Nazumi combo. I decided to whack on the number one backlink, and I'm using the color pink. But it goes very nice with the color of it, so it's pink and blue. Of his, of his jacket. The pickaxe is the beast claw for the blue and the pink, but you can also whack on the other pickaxe, which is the Mr. Beast Smasher, and use standard Mr. Beast Smasher style, because that's also blue and pink. But I decided to put the claw on, the beast claw, and then the wrap is beast backdrop for the pink and the blue. Once again, let's move on to the next combo. I decided to whack on a rainbow theme combo, and I'm using the neon wings with the pickaxe reel, which is J Balvin's pickaxe. And then the wrap is Rainbow Fog, just to go obviously the rainbow theme of this combat. I'd say I probably prefer the Exile Nazumi edit style over the standard Nazumi. I just find it so many, I found it easier to make combos for this compared to the, you know, the standard. Let's move on to the second last combo. I decided to whack on the Boba Bling, which is on the page with, with Helsey. And it's on the first page, this page here. So obviously when you first unlock your Helsey, this one here so i started to whack on it goes very nice the colors go very nicely with it so i thought one to whack a back wing, which is from this season obviously i know the first one was but i thought we used a different one that isn't nazumi's pickaxe is a leviathan axe just solely because of the blue goes quite nicely with obviously the blue on the on his jacket and the wrap is world cup 2019 oh you are 2019 so if you don't have this one just whack on any blue or purple weapon wrap i found this purple here is the closest to the actual purple on his on his actual this actual exile nazumi Edit style. Let's move on to the last combo for this one. I decided to whack on the Book of Spells Volume 3. And I'm using the color default, which is basically purple. Pickaxe is a Phantasmic Pulse. And I'm using the style Cosmic Edge. Primary color turquoise. Secondary color turquoise. Works very nice. It's probably the closest I could make to the blue, of the, obviously, on the jacket. And then the wrap is Polished Stone, which is from Chapter 3, Season 3's Battle Pass. I'll quickly get off this edit style or edit this combo because the back Book of, Spon Book of Spells Volume 3 always just keeps doing it over and over again. And it just keeps um, opening. It can be quite annoying. In the item shop, we have the Customize Your Hero stuff again. We have the Fey Ballet Bundle. It's a pretty cool skin. I probably won't pick it up because I'm waiting for the, Yan the, um, the Yanis skin to come out. So... Should be coming out tomorrow on Christmas. I'll probably be making combos for it on Christmas. I've still got the My Hero stuff. That'll probably stay till the My Hero Academia challenges go. We have the Star Wars stuff, which I was pretty surprised with some of the Star Wars stuff. Mr. Beast bundles here. Rick Grimes bundles still here. Cypher PK, Ali A, Ninja, Booga, Lockland, Graf G, Laser Beam, Loser Throat, Chica, Rainer bundle. I may pick up this to get the pickaxe and the glider for 400, but we've got the bundled up bundle. The gingerbread. Ginger Brigade bundle, the Gingerbread bundle, Nutcracker bundle, obviously with Christmas stuff, just more Christmas stuff, it's Black Ice Legends, and also the Frost Legends pack, which is pretty cool, obviously, and then the crew pack. But yeah, so if there is any videos like you see, skin combos, victory hours, back, back bling combos, anything Fortnite related, feel free to add in my comments below. As I did mention, tomorrow I'll be making combos for the newest icon skin, which is Yanis, which will be coming out tomorrow. AKA the Greek Freak, the Greek Freak. So I'll be making, he's got two skins and they're two separate skins. So I'm not sure if I'll do just do both or do one and then do the other one the next day. But yeah, other than that, I'm just going to wait to get the second style for for Helsey and I'll do the same. I've done the, the Nazumi skin. I'll be basically waiting until I get the second one so I can make combos for both. But yeah, anyways, that was pretty decent.